Voilà.
Oh my god.
Green. Oh my fucking god, you're alive, they didn't kill you. I thought maybe they assassinated you in a foreign country. Mom? Yeah, exactly. I changed my voice, sweetheart. How have you been? I'm calling from heaven, I miss you. <laughs> yeah, man, I'm back in one piece. Where the fuck have you been? Oh, that would that would qualify as a fucking tourist cell. <laughs> hey, Rolando, when are you going to be in L.A.? I need to talk to you. It's really fucking serious. Uh, not anytime soon, brother. Head back to Iraq in about a week and a half. Okay, how can I meet you anywhere in the United States if I have to fucking drive to you? How do I get to you? Uh, here in Dallas. Can you text me an address? I'll drive there. I need to see you. <laughs> I'll leave tonight. I'll be there in 24 to 36 hours. Okay. I don't want to fly because of the national security issues that I'm dealing with. Oh, that's not good. Oh, no, it's really a shit storm. <laughs> um, you see, when I got done taking out Orphan Secure with you, uh -huh. uh, did I tell you that I have a tendency to do things I probably shouldn't sometimes? No, what would you do? Well, according to a CIA guy who declassified and is in witness, I'm hiding my ass so they don't kill me someday, uh, who I bumped into accidentally, he, who, or, or he was just sent to warn me, um, he said, Kurt, if you had taken on the, the, you know, the poppy fields in Cambodia or something, you would have still had people pissed off, just not quite as many, but taking on global warming, rainforest, the UN, and the black market, he said, you might as well have just lit your ass on fire. I've had more terrorist threats, I've had hacking, I've had homeland security issues because I'm the voice for everything domestic and foreign on a lot of shit, and when they hit my VPN, they got army manuals, they got intel from Bangladesh, Israel, Pakistan, pick a country, I do voice work. They got the audio, the video, the transcripts, and I've even met with the FBI in some people either think I'm insane or full of shit, or as one agent told me, um, current active people have stand down orders on stuff they normally used to investigate because of all the corruption in upper government. And I'm actually quoting an agent who told me that at the FBI in Los Angeles Friday when I met with him. That's scary to me. Yeah, it should be. Because I'm getting death threats from the Illuminati, Freemasons, even the fucking Rothschilds. Help! Can I come and see you? Uh, yeah, that, that should work. We, we, our offset that we normally use is going to be available for us. Okay, well, I, I need some help. <laughs> Seriously. Um, okay. So maybe if we can talk in person, we can figure out some strategies. How Kurt stays alive and still gets his films out and doesn't get his ass shot off or get a red dot on the forehead. Yeah, but we, we, we can do that. Um, you see, it in 36 hours, what's today? Uh, Tuesday. So, how long does it take to drive to Dallas? If I've got a high-speed car, as long as I don't get arrested, I can probably track about 120 to 130 average speed. Okay. So, I'm not playing. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. So probably Thursday. I'm guessing. Well, how many miles is it from LA? I'm not in front of a computer that's working. Do you have any idea? Am I driving 1,500 miles? Yeah, roughly, it's, it's about three and a half hour flight, so it's about, 12, it's about that, about 14, 1500. Yeah, I've made it before, so 1500, I don't have a calculator in front of me. If I'm doing average speed of 100 miles an hour, that's 15 hours. I mean, I want to stop and piss a couple times. 24 to 36 hours sounds accurate. Okay, we'll just, uh, yeah, I'll be, I'll make sure we're available. We'll, uh, we'll 
we'll find a place to meet somewhere. How much data do I need to bring, or can we remote into the mod? Oh, shit, we can't remote in because AT&T turned my shit off. Fuck, I'll see how much data I can gather. If it takes too long, I may have to just bring some examples and show you some hidden shit on the internet. Okay. And okay. Then, uh, we'll figure out a way, and the rest I can substantiate with internet access. Um, do you have a place I can crash while I'm there, or should I make alternate accommodations? Right, well, that's what I'm saying. We had that available up until just a little while ago. We have a guy sitting here that's leaving Iraq with us, so that's not available to us anymore. So because of the intel. I don't have a place. I'll figure it out. I, I know people on the ground there in Texas. I'll... <laughs> okay. Uh, but I think at this point, are you still active uh, DOD or are you an um, independent operator? Uh, we're, we're our own We've got some stuff going on in our company. We created our uh, new company in, in uh, the one we, Fondor. The one we Fondor. talked about? The one we talked about? Uh, no, you, no, not at all. It's a whole other, another company. Something I might be uh, interested in or not? Something I'd be interested in or not? Uh, well, I don't know. It depends. We, uh, we, we're, got, we're closing some big, some, we're doing some stuff this week that could kind of change what we do. Okay. Can I, could I, stuff. could I throw another even bigger one at you that if you guys can take it on, could make you a fucking fortune? Um, you remember that little ditty that I was involved in called Live Aid? I think so, yeah. And Farm Aid and Kool Aid and Rock for the Americas, all those little ditties. I'd like to do 72 hour events in 25 major international cities, major coliseums, doing rock uh, and pop events, uh, you know, festivals, if you will, um, to benefit the rainforest, to raise awareness before the elections and after, during, as well as promote sustainable living. We can promote the orphan secure as part of the let's get our act together and stop fighting and learn how to coexist type shit. And I need somebody who can help with logistics to get shit in and out of countries, get me diplomatic clearances for my A-list, and make this thing tight so nobody gets killed while we're doing it. Um, yeah, we, have, we, we might be able to do that. That's... Well, what I need to know the budgets because obviously this project's probably going to cost somewhere between 150 to a quarter of a billion dollars, and I expect it to gross out a billion five over an 18 month period. So, as much as we can defer or do tax write off incentives, or you know, however, we need to structure it so I can put this deal together, I'd like to get it done and start doing concerts before the end of the summer. Well, that's it. We talk anytime we get here. Well, can you get, text me an address to this number so I know where I got to meet you? Uh, yeah, well, I'll get you into, it's 940 West Round Grove. Right. What, 940 West Round Grove, uh, it's uh, Louisville, Louisville, Texas. Uh, yeah. L-E-W-I-S. You want me to write this down or are you, are you texting it? Which, which would you prefer? Uh, is this your cell number? Yeah. Okay, I'll text it to you. And do you have my other cell number or not? In case. Uh, I don't think so. Okay, I'll text you back. Are you Apple or Android? I've got an Apple. Uh, include your email so I have a current one that you look at and I'll I'll send you a V card which is about 60 meg. You can import all kinds of data there. Okay, sounds good. And then I'll start sending you some links to Pink Cat ahead of time as I'm traveling when I get a second. All right, sounds good. Thanks. Look forward to meeting you yes, in person. Thank you. Talk to you later. All right, bye. bye. Gotta go ops now. I gotta go to black ops. Fuck. Uh, I'm glad I have the context to fucking pull this shit off. Motherfuck. I'd be dead if I didn't.
I've had follow-up with the FBI. I do need to speak with you at your earliest opportunity. Please find me. speak with you um, at your earliest opportunity. I need to talk to you about my calls and meetings with the FBI. Mm, fuck, man. And other black ops that I can't really tell you about because of the classification level of the information. Fuck. I love when my fucking hands are tied and I can't even communicate with friends properly. Motherfuck. Uh, and here is another one where I can't tell the truth. I just have to tell enough to cover what needs to be handled. Uh, it's a fucking juggling act of information. Sorry, the mailbox is full and there is oh, not enough... Oh, Jesus Christ. Uh, it's not going to work. Because that phone doesn't take text, so let's try it another way. That's what I need, and I need him. Good. This is a better way to fly. Hi, how are you? I tried to call your mom to thank you for having um, Sigfredo come over and fix the toilet, but the voicemail is full, so there's no way to leave a message. Um, and I also made a payment to her. I'm working on... Uh, the remaining balance, but I, I gave her the full month of May in cash, and um, I need to ask a favor, is my plan. So I don't have to have some other strange asshole come in and risk any more damage happening to my stuff or your potential for the house. If I put a big bag of cat food out by the washer, could you just make sure the cats have some food and fresh water for the next possible up to a week as I'm going you know, to lock the house up? I need to go to Dallas to meet with someone from the FBI who's going to try and help clean up this mess. They've asked me to meet them in person. I'm driving there. So I'm thinking there and back is going to take at least a week. I'll let you know if it'll be longer. If I can get money freed up sooner, I'll probably send you a cashier's check from the road uh, for the balance. Now, I would just ask that if you could... I'm going to leave bowl outside for cats and make sure all the cats are out when I leave. They're going to have to stay outside for a week. And I'll put a big bag of cat food up high where other creatures can't get it. If you could just give them some fresh food and fresh water every day so I don't have to have anybody else come here, I would really appreciate it. And I think it would be better for you. I'll leave it in the back. Uh, you know where that big cabinet is on the back porch by the washer dryer? I'll, I'll leave it sitting at, up in there, where it's high enough up that creek. Oh, that's fine. I'll leave it on the washer dryer then. That'll make it easy. Thank you so very much. I'm sorry about the problems. I'm doing everything I can as quickly as I can, including traveling around the country as needed to get this thing done. Thank you. Uh, cancer handle. Okay. Hey, what else are you gonna fucking do here, dude? Got a lot of fucking shit to get done so you can go fucking to Dallas, son of a bitch. Uh, mother, mother, fuck!
before you leave, anyone. Think it through. Anyone. shot. Okay, you got some good meal on now here in town. Get a different way where to put that other phone. Oh, shit, just a minute. Oh, look at this. Oh, too many fucking phones. Uh, I don't know where this is going to, but just post it. Who gives a shit at this point? Of course, it happens if I can double post. No, no, I can't talk to you people. Okay, breathe, uh, there, okay, you are truly running out of time, you 
been hammering and have about an hour to 90 minutes tops before I leave town to go on a thing I have to deal with. No, they don't need that much information. Sorry, I'm gonna get rid of this. You truly are running out of time. If you or Cameron don't return my money to me and the other stuff immediately in the next 90 minutes, not only will I have an LAPD involved, but you'll also be probed by the FBI, who will be sending in fingerprint experts and other people to look at the forensics. I'm not playing. You have 90 minutes. After that, it's a lost cause because it's becoming a federal matter because you tampered with evidence. Now, you're out of time. You have 90 minutes. This is your final warning. Have tampered And your terrorist friends possessions possessions intellectual property ID theft and other things that you have taken wrongfully from me without permission If they are not returned to me promptly, along with everything, notes, photos, audio, video, anything of mine that you have in your possession, returned. Forensic. And other expert 